So today, I'm going to show you guys how I take out the lower bumper and remove my wing. Here's uh, some instructions from GM. First, I jack the car up. Take out the reflectors. Take all the bolts off underneath the lower diffuser or fascia. Next, gotta take the ACS extender off. The hardest one is the APR. Yes, and right now it's the safety bumper. So you can tell I have the diffuser and the APR on the tray. Fixing the APR on the tray, I have a bunch of different bolts underneath it that I couldn't reach before. It's easier now, I can take the whole thing off, reach rail it, and do rev it on every one of this. Using some touch out paint to fix the imperfections. It's pretty much all done. It's taking off the safety bumper, the lower fascia bumper, the user on the tray. The next, I gotta have to uh, take out the wing. It's all carbon fiber. Really helps the driving and suck the force down, clean the air up. So for the wing, I gotta reach my hand underneath of it, remove three bolts. Take the APR off first. That wasn't that hard. I'll take this off. Three bolts each side. Three bolts from the chassis. You can tell in that picture. And then put everything back again. Basically, reverse what I did and redo everything. It really helps if you can have an impact driver. I've done this before, it took me all day, 8 hours. With the impact driver, all the screw go back in straight. I finished this whole thing in 3 hours. Pull the car back in and check out the result. Looks pretty sweet. What I'm gonna do is I might powder coat the old bracket or just make a new bracket, you know, and most likely I'll probably call the wheel black to get that really low look. Thanks for watching. Remember to hit like, subscribe, and see you guys next